Okie dokie. Well, good evening, everybody, and time for another. Decided to go ahead and make a Gems of War video, and I'm gonna try to keep this short, cause I still have a blog post I gotta work on, and on top of that, I still have a. I still gotta work tonight, so much to do and not a whole lot of time to do it in. So, but anyway, um, so shortly after finishing up my stream, uh, opening my chest, and well, what do you know? King Avalon appeared. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, about damn time. Oh, thank you. My freaking God, man. So many, I mean, so many teams I've been, uh, so many teams I've been seeing that, uh, use King Avalor, and I'm like, God, I wish I had one. Boy, I guess they just had bad luck or something, you know, that kind of thing. Well, lo and, lo lo and behold, like I said, Right after I finished my stream, King Avalon appeared in one of the chests. Holy shit. Yeah. Shit. So, anyway. Um, so what I decided to go ahead and do is, uh, kind of called an audible. Oh, and, uh, before I continue on, um, the music. And already I screwed that up, so let me fix that. Okay, there we go. Okay, anyway, I'm going to have this running in the background, and this is kind of risky, because, I, yeah, I said, like, all rights reserved to Blizzard Entertainment, um, but, like I said, I can't think of anything else I want in the background right now than, than uh, some Night Elf music from WoW. So, this is going to be the tavern stuff, and I have it set it to, I have it set to loop. Okay, so anyway, I um, just did some experimenting around, um, trying out different stuff, and this is what I came up with. This is my Keebler Elves build, and let's see here. Just starting with that, all-time classic right here. Oh, and um, I'm going with the Monk class, because um, Monk is classified as Elf. And yeah, I've done some, uh, done some battles with him, 27. And, and all this can't be drained, can't be silenced. Uh, gets uh, three mana when matching four or more gems. And right now, and because I'm not currently using a hammer, uh, I'm kind of debating here. I want to say, yeah, I'll just go ahead and do that. That way, so, so I'm not having to wait around for a 4 or 5 jump match. But I just find this to be a more fun way to level than sitting here and doing, doing a bunch of uh, difficulty 1 runs. So, but anyway, this, that's the class I'm working on. And then, like I said, the weapon. It's an all-time classic right here, Essence of Evil. Excuse me. Ugh. Anyway, and uh, although... If I'd, have known, if I'd have known that what I know now... I would not have fully uh, upgraded this weapon. This hex tier can actually be a pretty big pain in the ass. So, but and, um, then we got Tulio. Same thing here. Immune to silence and mana drain and all that. Um, you just pick a color, and most likely it's gonna be green. So I mean, just the six mana alone is enough. I mean, it a chance to hold team. And give six mana to him, boosted by gems of that color. But the boost ratio, four for one. You know, mean meaning four green gems for one mana. Not that, not really that valuable. I mean, unless you have a boatload of green gems on the board, but that. I mean, maybe later on, because I believe. Guess that ain't in here. But that is. And that, but yeah, I don't see uh, someone a leaf storm or anything like that. So, so you could just um, you could you could just go ahead and pick green every time, as long as there's at least one green gem on the board. Otherwise, I'd probably say yellow would be the alternative. So then um, 
Rakti and Weaver, another all-time classic. Yeah, not, not much of a concern with the Creeping Doom. I like the Impervious, though. Stealthy as well. Man, that is one funky-looking elf. That's an elven experiment gone wrong right there. And again, it, it webs everybody, deals 43, 43 true damage, and if one of them croaks, you blow up 15 gems, but it's just a nice little bonus because Essence of Evil already does that. And you got King Abby, and... It, and again. Yeah, finally got the guy. About frickin' time. But the big one with, the big one with him... All elf allies start with 50% mana. And let me sound check this again. I hardly hear it. Hang on. Alright. Going for broke. Just jacking the volume up to the max. Like I said, I can hardly hear it. And I, I actually do have the volume jacked up from my end. Probably turn it down a little bit. There we go. 75%. Okay, so. Ah, uh, banner. Since this is going to be very green heavy. Green and yellow. Not red. Not brown. I'll go with this one here. Warren Banner. Minus blue. Not that big of a deal since uh, King Avalorn is only really there for the uh, LP start with 50% mana. Got that. Alright, so let's go ahead and do a D12 run. And I did test I did test a couple of these, so it, it's doable. about that so and we already got that going that's all it's Rakti and Weaver and then again again just go with green the, the boost ratio I mean, the boost ratio really isn't that impressive to go with anything else. So, everyone's enchanted. So, oh, 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 oh. Do that. Do that. Alright. Well, I'm being spoiled right now. with this guy all right so I'll go ahead and leave nightmare alone see what we got here okay so he had... thought he got transformed or something so let's do it again more green Like I said, doable in D12. Let's do another. Um, and I might go ahead and try a PvP 
try some PvP, but you, you uh, cursing and cleansing is pretty much a requirement for running those, especially the high tier ones. Um, unless you can get this off, like hit them before they hit you. So anyway. about that. Around the home stretch. Oh, there we go. boss battle and I guess since we're here might as well do the um do the mythic boss too holy shit ah good way to start up a bit short. more battle and I'll go ahead and do a PvP one. And I'm really hoping this video doesn't get copyright claimed, but like I said earlier, I couldn't think of any other kind of background music than this. big colors to go for is as obvious as it might sound is green and then yellow
Might as well. Oh, somebody got transformed. Like I said, this is one drawback of uh, Essence of Evil. I think one of the debuffs is uh, Lycanthropy, which turns him into a random, small random chance to turn him into a random beast. So, I could actually do more harm than good. Just finishing them off. Ooh. Another token of Anu. Alright, so let's try a PvP. And let's just... Well, let's just go for broke. Again, I have no way of cleansing, so... this on her just if only for the stun Zolgoth is next all right since so the bottom two are debuffed um, Is she? Ah, that's why. Shaman, alright. And same thing, like always, just go with green. Again, the uh, the boost ratio, it's not there it's not really that impressive. Now, if the ratio is like one for one or even two for one, then yeah, maybe I'd start considering other colors. More, you know. But like I said. Um, so let's go ahead and shut her down. And another bonus, though, I, I also forgot to mention, too. Um, it should be in there. Yeah, damned. Curse the first enemy. So. Let's look for a green or a brown. There we go. Nice little bonus and a frozen. So now we'll nab the top guy. I mean, normally when you use that, you want to aim for the guy on the top. But again, this is... I'm up against Queen Bee and Zolga, so they're the higher priority. Here you go, bye-bye. Almost. Can't say a Well, barely not. I'll up the bleed a little bit. And I'll just go ahead and do that. Oh, that's right. Fairy fire. I keep forgetting about that debuff. 
but yeah. Oh, I should have should let it run a little more. <sighs> Wanted to see who the MVP was. Um, yeah, I'll go ahead and go for it. But um, this this is def this is definitely gonna be the last battle for this video. I figured, hell, since I took down uh, Zolgoth and Queen Bee, well, I figured these guys shouldn't be too difficult. Shouldn't. Of course, with the board I got right now, I'm gonna be some slow going. Totally forgot about the. Oh yeah, good thing I nailed him first too. But like I said, I have no way to. I have no cleansing on this group, so. Uh. Sound. Cool. Got lucky there. Um, let's just do that. Another weakness of um, essence of evil. Stealthy, stealthy people squeak right by it. I'll just do that. Um, oh, guess it's gonna be him. I'm gonna go ahead and do that, get him out of there, because otherwise he's just gonna keep summoning spiders. So that's gonna do it for me. Um, I just wanted to put this video out there, kind of documenting this whole thing. So, uh, but otherwise, hey, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye for now.